Um, hi, Thomas. Commiserations on the result. Just wanted to get your thoughts on the game, first of all. <clears throat> I think it was um, exactly the game I, I expected. Um, it to be very difficult with a very energetic, uh, well-organized Sheffield United side. Um, and I think Sheffield United did well today um, in, in many ways. Uh, and the game, I thought, was very very tight, um, very even, and um, we uh, and I, it looked like it was a game that had to be decided by a, a, a one top action. I think until the top actions, yes, difficult, but I, th I felt that we were more on top, and I felt we created some some dangerous situations. And Sheffield United had nothing, uh, but you know, difficult. Uh, and then the the uh, the, uh, the top action from Makati, um top corner, and then second half was yeah uh, uh, yeah difficult. We didn't have the the the, the action that could have uh, got an equalizer or or the enough how can you say on our offensive performance, and that means um, structure actions, bit of that, and that that means that you means that you lose in the Premier League. I know you spoke on Thursday about somebody needed to step up while Brian's injured. Did you see anybody try to take on that responsibility today? I saw a lot of effort from the players. Can't can't complain uh, about that. Uh, these players are very honest. They give everything. Um, I, I see I see Wisser and I see Neil Mope and I see Kieran Lewis Potter. Do everything they can to to, to, to take. Um, uh, not not not. Uh, but I have to take. I can say do everything they can to to uh, try to be decisive. <laughs> uh, unfortunately, on the, today they, they didn't succeed uh, at, a, at a top level. Um, just wanted to ask about taking Frank on Yaka off at half time. What was behind that? A yellow card. So it was just a very physical game. Uh, and I felt that that could have been uh, some 50-50s and we are down 1-0 then maybe maybe we couldn't uh, control the game enough maybe it'll be a transitions back and forth and that's why I did um, Just final one from me something I noticed I don't think Brentford have won a game outside of London since March I think it was the 2-0 versus Southampton is there any reason you might think that would be the case? Apparently we can only play well in London no, <laughs> no. <laughs> it's a little bit with these stats. I'm a little bit. Yeah. First, we were unbeaten in 14 London derbies. How much it was? Um, I think there's a lot, a lot more into to these um, results or performances. Um, yeah. Thank you. Anything else? Perfect. Thank you. Oh, no, 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 no. We have one. Feel free. Is it? You know these. No, exactly. Yeah. Yeah. Now, just saying, how, how big a miss was Embuemo uh, for you today? Of course, big. It's clear. We we uh, we have lost our best offensive uh, player uh, this season. I think I can't even. Jay, you maybe know that more. How many goal uh, contributions he's had this season? Nine and fifteen. Nine and fifteen. I think. No, it's things more. I think, no, 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 it's more. Yeah, I think it's 11, 15, something like that. I think it's seven goals and four assists. That says everything. Um, I shouldn't have asked you. I put you on the spot. <laughs> <laughs> uh, yeah, yeah, exactly. Yeah. Uh, so, of course, that's big. That, 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 that is big, you know. Uh, to, to take any of um, that top producer out of any of the top sides, and they will also feel a little bit... Mm -hmm. Um, but it is what it is. Uh, it's up to me to find solutions for it, and it's up to some of the other players to step up. And uh, as we talked about before, I saw a lot of effort, I saw a lot of trying, and sometimes it doesn't succeed the first time. Hopefully, we get another chance uh, on Sunday, and hopefully, we um, we will uh, come out in an even better place, and some of the offensive players will will take that um, step forward. Do you feel a little bit unlucky? Like obviously, you seem to be getting players back, and then another another injury comes. So it's kind of like you're not you're not having the your, your full squad. Yeah, I, I f to be fair, injuries is part of the game. I feel we are very unlucky um, with the squad we have, which is a good squad. 
I love my players. I think they're very honest. They work very hard. Uh, we don't have the same depth as other other teams. And what they have produced so far is incredible. And I saw a lot of effort today. Uh, again, uh, of course, uh, it, it, it's big when you have eight plus uh, Ivan out as nine uh, players. Uh, so, but hey, it is what it is. We will find um, find a way. Is it a situation that you think you know? You're not scared of, but you, you're kind of worrying about. Obviously, going into Christmas when there's a lot of games coming up, thick and fast. Uh, yeah, uh, I would say I think uh, that, that, that that's of course um, a worry. Um, <coughs> I think that I think we maybe are privileged with the program um, that we not have five games but three. I think so. Um, maybe we got a tiny bit of luck there, but I prefer to have my players and then play five players and uh, five five games.